What's good everybody, it's Malcolm from Tapped In Wellness here and we're back with another recipe video. For this week we're going to be taking a look at a cauliflower crust pizza. This is a nice simple easy recipe that you can use when you need that pizza fix all while keeping it plant based and health conscious. So let's get right into it. Alright so first things first we're going to get into the foundation of our recipe, this cauliflower rice. This is about 4 cups worth or a small head of cauliflower's worth, which is about equivalent to a half large head of cauliflower. You can simply grate the cauliflower on a cheese grater yourself or put it through a food processor to get nice uniform pieces. So we're gonna steam this for about 10 minutes so it can get nice and soft, and we're gonna strain the water off. Our cauliflower's been steamed for about 10 minutes. It's nice and soft, and we can set it aside to let it cool before we strain the water off. So to strain this juice off, we're gonna need a nut milk bag or a cheesecloth, something really fine you can get all that liquid out from. So this is the texture you're looking for once the cauliflower is steamed and strained. This is gonna provide the base for our cauliflower crust. Now we can begin to build our crust. Now that we have our steamed and strained cauliflower, we can go in with the rest of our dry ingredients. So we have half a cup of all-purpose flour here. You can use any flour you like that's going in. We have our Italian spice mix. This is composed of basil, oregano, parsley, salt, pepper, and this is really customizable to your taste as well. We have three tablespoons of nutritional yeast and we have one flax egg. Now we can mix this until our dough starts to form. Once our dough is formed, we can line our baking pan and get it into the oven. We're gonna bake this in our 450 degree oven for 10 minutes until partially cooked. Put on our toppings and finish baking. So our crust has been baking for about 10 minutes now. It's at this point we could take it out, put our sauce and toppings on, and let it finish off for another 10 minutes. This part of the recipe is highly customizable, but for my toppings today, I'm using some Miyoko's vegan mozzarella, some brown mushrooms, green peppers, and red onions. So we have our toppings on. We can put it back in the oven for another 10 minutes, let it finish cooking, and it will be good to go. So it's been an additional 10 minutes. We can get our pizza out the oven, and serve it up. All right, everybody, and that is it. A nice, simple, easy, plant-based pizza recipe. If you guys like this video, be sure to hit that like button down below and subscribe to the channel while you're there. You can also follow me on Instagram at Tapped In Wellness for more content. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.